Hey, we are following up on that nasty wreck that happened along 670 yesterday that closed down the freeway uh, for quite some time last night. So here's what we do know from investigators. So they do confirm that there was a driver and four passengers in a truck. They were driving along 670 westbound uh, before the driver lost control, struck a guardrail, uh, having that truck flip over, but also two of those passengers even ejected from the truck. Now we're learning that those two, they were sent out to Nationwide Children's Hospital, one in critical, another in serious yet stable condition, and they're still recovering over at Nationwide Children's Hospital, and we're learning that both of them were just eight and 13 years old. Now there were two other passengers that were also sent to Riverside, uh, one of them just 15 and the other an adult passenger. Uh, now they were treated for minor injuries, but you know some of the things that investigators and we're still looking into is really what caused that crash. Uh, as you can see here, this is 670 near 315, a very, very busy intersection and I know it's tough to see, but uh, you know things are back up and running. There are a couple of orange cones along the roadway there as well, but roadways both 315 and 670 they are back open but beyond us looking into uh what happened here we're also putting a request for those 911s and again figuring out really what all played out here just last night